Hey, what's happening, gamers? It's Amber here with Gaming's Let's Plays. Hope you guys are all having a great day today. Today, um, it's a quick change of plans. Uh, we were having some problems uh, with um, stuff that was happening on other streams. So we actually had to change streams and uh, we are going to be doing some Scrabble coin and see how that goes. Uh, I actually did try to... All right, so we're back. Um, bear in mind, we are uh, getting cyber attack today, so it will probably go on for several hours, and I still have to do my job, so just bear in mind that every several minutes, they will be attacking me. Um, but we are going to do um, the Scrabble coin nonetheless, because that's why we're doing Scrabble coin today, because I don't really, uh, it doesn't really bother me that much since it's just a coin game. Okay, so we're going to see if we can play some Scrabble coin with Donald here. Alright, do we want to play Scrabble coin? Uh, level 2. Uh, get ready for a win. I'm the best Scrabble coin player in the valley. Alright, we'll see about that, Donald. You're going down. So we're going to choose our figurines. Alright, so um, we're going to go ahead and we're going to put, I think, Donald on here. I'm going to put him down here. Alright, so next we're going to go with, um, I think I'm going to go with Uncle Scrooge because he gives me... Uh, I think he can go in any direction. Oh, actually, you know what? We're going to go with Lumiere, I think. Okay. All right. Um, so we've already moved those characters. I guess we're going to move, um, Donald. Let's see. All right. So basically this game is, um, uh, you basically uh, have different pieces that are members of Disney Dreamlight Valley. And okay, so it looks like we can actually bring Goofy in now since we're in that stage of the game. So I think we should replace uh, Lumiere with Goofy. Let me go. So we're going to have him go over here. Have Scrooge McDuck go... Um, Actually, let's see if we can move. Okay. All right. So let's see. Um, we're gonna skip this for now. I'm gonna have. Uh, we're gonna have Donald Duck go this direction. I'm gonna have uh, Mr. Scrooge go. up here and we're gonna have goofy he can move anywhere so the gold coins are worth three 
Um, you basically, each character has different moveset. It's kind of like chess a little bit. So that's kind of what, um, what it is. Ranking points plus three. So basically what we're going to do today is we're going to try to get through the whole board of Scrabble coin and unlock all these characters. Um, so maybe we'll do something else if we get a chance to do it. Um, all right, let's see. Well, okay, so we got three points for that. We played Donald. That was that. Alright, so thanks again for the super chat. Um, Sons of Gaming, really appreciate that. And thanks for the thoughts and prayers, uh, Tim and everyone. Really appreciate that. Um, thank you guys so much for, for being kind and for staying on the, the stream. Because um, it, like, it looks like for, uh, at least for now, I'm able to see something going on. All right, thank you guys for the 44 likes. Really appreciate that, guys and gals. That helps out tremendously. Yeah, um, if you guys can go back and watch Ace Attorney, that will help out tremendously. Appreciate that. Thank you, um, Colin. Thanks, everyone. Um, hi, everyone in the chat. Hello, PJ. Hi, Miss Deanna. Hi, Michael. Hi Jessica, Jacob, HM Goldbeck, and Charles Demers. Hello Game Wing One. Um, thanks again for becoming an ultimate today, Game Wing, and I appreciate that so much. Hi Phantom J Dog. Uh, J Dog. Hi Empty Space. Hello everyone. Um, hope you guys are all doing fantastic today. Oops, I don't can't seem to scroll up so. Hi, Werewolf Girl. Hi, everyone. Hope you guys are all having a great day. So just bear in mind that the person interfering may come and go throughout the stream. Um, I am currently trying to download the some like updates for like Fall Guys and also like um, Fortnite. So I don't know what kind of stream we'll be doing tonight. Right now, the Final Fantasy stream is moved to tomorrow. Who knows if if they are done maybe I could we can do it today but I don't know all right so we're going to um yeah yeah it's a I was just talking to my aunt today and it's you know and obviously these people that are it's attacking like us are inside. looking like listening so like you know, like if I, like today, I think they may have attacked because I said I was sick and I, you know, I'm exhausted. That may be a reason why they attacked. Um, they, they don't act like normal people. They act kind of like demons where, you know, you say that you're sick and you're like dying and then they're like, awesome, I'm going to attack you more. So they're just, um, yeah, they're just, uh, you know, and I, um, and I, I believe in my heart, I know, you know, I was, uh, praying about it, and I really believe in my heart, I know the reason why that they are attacking, um, so it doesn't really, um, uh, it doesn't really get to me as much as it used to, of course, I'm losing income, and I'm in danger of things, but, um, knowing, you know, that I believe I know the reason why, you know, that, um, so it's, there's nothing I can, you know, do about it, so they're gonna just keep going, um, but yeah, we, it's just gonna be a long, uh, long process, um, nothing, uh, nothing, actually, not the hardest thing that I've faced in my life, not the hardest thing Luke has faced in his life, um, Luke and I have had difficult times, uh, in our life that have been much worse than this, believe it or not. Uh, um, when Luke and I, uh, when I first married Luke, we actually, I, Luke thought he was going to die and I thought Luke was going to die as well. 
He almost died from his car accident, and years later, he almost died um, for years on end. He was in danger of dying, so... Uh, it's not the hardest thing that I've actually had to deal with, so... Um, can be worse things in life than having your income constantly being destroyed every day. There are actually worse things that could happen, believe it or not. Alright, so we are going to try to find some people to play Scrabble Coin with. And if you guys saw the last episode, I am going to edit it so that... Um, I'm going to edit the last episode uh, thumbnail so that you can see the... Um, uh, so it will say Cave of Wonders. Um, we did go into the Cave of Wonders last time, so I can actually show you guys a little bit of that if you want. Oh, I have a lot of memories? Oh, thank you, Shadow Trooper. Oh, yeah, memories in the game? Definitely. Yeah, and I, like, for some of these games, like, where I'm doing Scrabble Coin and we'll and probably unlock some stuff as well. Um, you know, like, if, if I'm being heavily attacked, which seems to be a normal Need thing at this point, um, you know, you guys can keep the, you know, if you're watching a movie or something, you can also watch the stream at the same time or something, or, you know, like, you don't, I'm not gonna be offended, um, you know, it's gonna be very difficult to watch back with the, me having to pause the stream every three seconds, uh, to deal with the problem. So, I I completely understand, but right now it looks like we're um, surviving at least. All right. Um. Yeah. And thank you, uh, person who said they used to watch uh, a long time ago. I um, really appreciate that. Thank you. All right. Um. All right. So let's actually try to play Scrabble Coin with Goofy. Ooh. He's a level one, so we can try that. So today, um, somebody suggested a marathon for Scrabble Coin. Later, Gator did. So we're gonna try it. Okay, so this is gonna be twenty-eight. Uh, goofy. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I mean, like. You know, just like there are, you know, like I feel like the kind of people that are really attacking us, like, you know, the, you know, like, you know, humans, they disagree, they attack each other, and they dispute over certain things, but, you know, like demons, they attack people, and they just want to kill everybody, and they just want to ruin everyone's day, and they want to take all joy and all goodness away from the world. And that's the kind of people that are really attacking at this point. They are just uh, very demonic and they just want to steal everyone's joy. They want to destroy everything. So, you know, they're really, you can't really, uh, these kind of people, you really can't, um, you know, uh, you really can't fathom like the kind of, uh, like evil that they are so it's uh you can't really say to yourself you know like oh maybe if I you know like you can't really say to yourself oh like oh if I'm if I'm nicer to a demon they'll be nicer to me it doesn't work like that um they're going to attack you anyway so you might as well just live your life and um just just kind of ignore them and just let them keep attacking you and don't get angry about it just you know just keep going and that's all you can really do okay, so all right so we're gonna play goofy and scrabble coin are you too happy awesome game wing yeah definitely There you go. Yep, definitely. That's a good thing to be. Yeah, anything. I mean, that's, um, you know, I'm like, even like, I think like a lot of, like, one of the organizations that's attacking, uh, that we 
that seemed to be attacking us, um, you know, I had never really had that kind of attack until certain people talked about a certain organization, and it may be that organization that it's attacking us, actually, um, it may have been somebody else to begin with, but maybe that, those people, um, and, you know, these kind of people that are, if it is that kind of people, then it, you know, those people are just trying to destroy gaming in general, trying to ruin it for everyone. So, um, you know, you really, you can't, you can't sit there and say to yourself, oh, I wonder if I just changed my personality or my topics, will they stop attacking me? They, they won't. Um, they're going to attack you no matter what. So you can't, you might as well just uh, forget about it. Alright, so basically this is a super uh, somewhat boring game that you play in Disney Dreamlight Valley. If you guys haven't seen me play Disney Dreamlight Valley, Luke and I were playing this game um, in the afternoons until basically we, one of our computers got destroyed. And... Um, yeah, and then um, I'm like, yay! <laughs> um, one of our computers got destroyed, and so we didn't have the thumbnail design anymore for the for the for the game. So we stopped playing Disney Dreamlight Valley, and then after a while, I did the thumbnail. But by that time, it was uh, too late. Like we, no one had seen us play it for a while, so it was kind of like. So I just picked it up, and I was um, just Luke didn't have that much time to do Disney because we were doing you know, Final Fantasy, um, uh, Spider-Man, all this other stuff that was more popular. So I was just doing Disney Dreamlight Valley and, um, I have fun doing it. It's pretty fun. I like voice, like it's been, uh, I've been able to practice voicing the characters and stuff. So I voice like Goofy and everything. So, um, it's kind of fun. And then I'm able to do better on voices like later in the day when Luke wants me to voice a character. So that works out really well. <sighs> um, yeah, I mean, let's. Yeah, I mean, it's nothing, it's nothing new. I mean, we've always been, I think we've always been attacked online since day one that we've been online, but, um, they couldn't really get to us as well. I think, um, now that our channel got hacked in 2020 and our, uh, we're not seen in the search engine We're a lot, it's a lot, um, it's a lot easier for them to attack us because we're already down. Um, you know, like if we were if we were raking in the money and everything, and we got attacked, we could just not stream for a day and be completely fine and take a day off and go to the movies, and there would be no problem. But you know, because we need the money, then that's why they're really doing it. Because that, in their mind. Um, you know, they can put the final nail in the coffin of K-Wing's Let's Plays. That will be their legacy um, that they will that they will be proud of. Um, so, um, but, you know, um, you know, you don't have to be afraid when bad things happen to you in life because, um, you know, bad things actually are there. Uh, believe it or not, bad things actually are going to help you in life. Um, because um, the, the more bad things that happen to you, um, you know, it really uh, helps you to be a better, more compassionate person. You can't really learn to be kind and compassionate when nothing bad ever happens to you. You can't really learn to be a good person if nothing bad happens to you. So um, it's actually it's actually a good thing when bad things happen to you because you can learn from that. So, uh, you know, it's, it's going to be okay. Uh, you know, God's got our back and, um, it's, you know, it's going to be, it's going to be all right. 
and I'm 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 talking I'm 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 acting fine now, but like if I see my bank account dipping and the views dropping, yeah, I probably will have a nervous breakdown later. But I'm just trying to be positive right now, so hopefully it will be all right. Uh so we uh we unlocked another character. All right, fairy godmother. All right, so we unlocked the fairy godmother, and we just uh, played Goofy. Um, well, wow. you know, here's the thing that Luke and I, um, to be completely honest, um, you know, Luke and I were in a, uh, you know, he had had a car accident. Um, he kept collapsing at work and, um, he wasn't able to, um, really function because of his car accident. He almost died. And, um, Luke and I prayed a lot and, uh, we ended up doing YouTube and, um, we did, uh, Luke did Nightwing 01 and we did K-Wings Let's Plays and so really our YouTube channel was an answer to prayer and, you know, God gives and he takes away. So if God doesn't want us to be here, then, you know, he can always take it away from us. But, you know, I'm thankful for every day that I've had on the channel. Um, so it's really... It's not in the hacker's hands uh, whether I stay here or not. It's in God's hands. God can decide if he wants me here or not. So they, like uh, the famous uh, verse, you know, you have no power. Uh, no one has any power except which is given to them from above. So um, if, the, if the hacker ends up taking my channel down, it was because God allowed them to. And if they do not take my channel down, it's because God did not allow them to. So I know that I'm in God's hands no matter what happens. So it's, um, I, so I don't need to fear, um, people. I just need to fear God. So it will be, you know, I don't need to worry because they have no, no power. They only think that they have power. There's a lot about this valley. It appears as though they have power, but they don't. It, it appears like that, but they really don't. If, you know, if, uh, you know, if, uh, for some reason God allows the hacker to take the channel down, then God will use it for something good in the world, so... I definitely, um... Yeah. Uh, so we're gonna, uh, we're gonna try, uh, let's see if we can talk to some other people, uh, to try to do, um... Eve! Uh, all right, so let's see if we can play Scrabble Coin with Eve. Eve is level two. Definitely t to me the Sailor Venus fan. Yep, God has the power. Yep. I'm just, uh, I'm not really, uh, I'm not really that good. I'm not really a good person. God is good. God has been good to me. And I know, I know that I've been through so many things in life. I know I would be an idiot not to, uh, not to know, not to know that God has my channel. I didn't, uh, when, when we, um, Let's see, Luke had the Nightwing 01 channel and we were in a very difficult position and we prayed tremendously. Um, 
um, for, for help because, um, there was a problem going on that we needed to, uh, be free of that very, very bad situation and, um, prayed for help that we could have, um, money to be, uh, to be able to afford, we didn't even have money to pay rent even for one month. Um, and we prayed about it and, um, the channel went from 30,000 subscribers to 100,000 subscribers in like three months. And K-Wings Let's Plays was born because we prayed about it and asked God for help. So God doesn't help people because they're good people. God helps people because they ask for help and that they need help. God, God helps people because he's good, not because people are good necessarily. Not God helped me not because I'm good, but because God is good. That's one thing that I have learned in life is that, you know, sometimes you are afraid to ask God to help you because you think, why would God help me? Because I'm not a good person or I'm not perfect or I'm not doing things right in life. But God doesn't help you because you're good. God helps you because he's good. So, you know, if if you're created by God, which if you're a human being, then you are. Then that means God wants to help you. So you don't need to feel afraid to ask God for help. Um, just because you haven't done everything right in life doesn't mean God doesn't want to help you. Well, anyway, sorry. It's very it's very hard for me cuz I keep thinking they're going to hack me again. I'm really trying to be positive about this, but it is difficult for me, but as soon as they I hear they hear me say that they're gonna do it again. <laughs> so, but I can just talk about my day, and I hope you guys had a nice Easter. Um, you know, like this, uh, it is hard for Luke to actually go out of the house a lot um, because of his he has a leg problem, he has breathing issues, and everything. So I was happy that he was able to get out of the house and go uh, with me for Easter. Um, so that was really nice, and, um, we kind of had to leave a little early, like, at the ending songs, because Luke's, um, leg was acting up, and so it was, like, really bothering him, he was in a lot of pain, but we talked to some people in the back, so that was kind of nice, um, uh, before we left, and he got some information about the church and stuff, so that was nice, and, um, yeah, and, uh, um, I'm still trying to, f um, yeah, today I w ended up talking to my aunt a lot, which was nice. My aunt lives in Pennsylvania, and um, uh, she's a very uh, sweet person. I just, um, so I might end up going, um, I never quite know where I'm going to go for Thanksgiving. I usually end up just cooking for me and Luke, but I was able to actually talk to her about, um, like, maybe going to her place for Thanksgiving or something, and so that was a really nice conversation I had today, so that was a good good day um yeah so and uh I can't think of anything else that exciting usually my streams in the morning are just kind of like good morning and this is my day so um I'm just kind of doing a filler stream right now um Luke is the exciting one of both of us so um so yeah so I'm gonna kind of describe like what the game is like so basically um I really like these three characters for um, Scrabble Coin. Uh, Mr. Scrooge, basically, he can do one one move, and then he gets another coin. And um, um, let's see. Uh, and then, whoop. Okay, there we go. We're going to go over there. So then, um, yeah, and then I like Go Goofy is great to bring in when the gold coins are brought out because he can easily hop to them. Um, Donald is a great uh, piece to put on your board. You can only pick uh, five 
uh, pieces to have in your like hand at the bottom there. And then you can only pick like three people to have on the board at a time. They don't really explain the rules very well to this game. Like when you first start out, you kind of have to figure it out by playing it. Uh, you just kind of have to wing it basically. So, um, yeah, so that's why my, my go-to people are basically, um, uh, Mr. Scrooge, Donald, and then Goofy, and then I also like Lumiere at the beginning. Then I re usually replace him with Goofy. But we can go just, uh, hang out in, uh, Disney Dreamlight Valley and just run around. Um, we can also go to the Cave of Wonders, because we've already been there. We can, I can show you guys what that looks like. All right. All right, so we're going to go, right now it's asking us to put more people on the board. We already have our best three characters on the board, which is Goofy, Donald, and Mr. Scrooge. So we don't actually need to, um, add anyone. So you can just go to skip. Um, um, yeah, and just so you guys know, like, Luke just went to bed. Maybe he will be on a later stream if he has an ultimate or something. I don't know. He has to look at that. He just went to rest a little because he could use some sleep anyway. So it it's, you know, going to work out fine for him. Um, yeah. Yeah, I actually tried to make like a makeshift dish for Easter with carrots because I thought, oh, this will be great. I'll make carrots for Easter. But I really need to go with an actual recipe because I kind of made my own recipe and it really didn't work out very well. Like it just poured honey on the carrots and it that did not work well at all. I think like I really need to, um, I could, I could easily find a great um, recipe online for that. Um, so, yeah, I was able to give a, a voice message to Luke's family for Easter and, um, a voice message to Luke's sister today, so, and I, I was able to actually get, like, a little, um, I'll send a little plushie because we get, um, Amazon Prime, so I was able to send, like, a small plushie to my niece, um, today. So that was really nice, a little unicorn plush. Uh, so it's her birthday tomorrow, so that will be really nice. So I feel, you know, I always, I don't like it when I have a lot of birthdays and holidays all together. I have like Thanksgiving and then Christmas and then my birthday and then Luke's birthday and then my, and then St. Patrick's Day, which used to be a huge holiday for Luke's family because they're Irish. Then my sister-in-law's birthday is like on St. Patrick's Day. Then, you know, my brother's birthday is seven days after that. It's like everyone's birthday is between like December and March. Everybody's birthday and every holiday is, is right there. So, um, all right. So we can actually see what, we can see what the fairy godmother piece looks like. Um, what is Scrabble Coin? Uh, Soulstorm. Hi, Soulstorm. Great to see you. <laughs> um, you're a, you're a great person, Game Wing. Thank you for uh helping us out and for your generosity. You're a very good person, Game Wing. Thank you. Um, basically, it's this game that they added into Disney Dreamlight Valley to kind of like. It's like a new part of the the game where you can just play with different people. So, and then you can unlock. I think, let's see what we can actually unlock. Because I don't really know yet. I believe you can unlock statues. So I think like these are the statues I'm actually earning. I think, I haven't even put them out on the... Um, I haven't actually put put the statues out. Let's see. I think you actually earn real statues in real life once you play. I mean, they don't send it to your actual house, but they, you can earn it in the game. So, um, if you guys are wondering why I like to do Disney Dreamlight Valley, it's just a very peaceful game. It really calms me down. I have very high blood pressure. Um, today I actually had blood pressure that was very high, which is why Luke had to keep waking up, which is why he was so tired. Because my blood pressure was up to 173, um, which is extremely high. Like, 
the peop- the nurses at the clinic kind of got angry at me. Not angry, but you could tell they were kind of mad because, um, like I, um, oh, so it's like kind of small, small figurines that you get. So you kind of get these cute little figurines, um, to post. So you can kind of put them on the map. Okay, so you can kind of make your own... Uh, there's mini. I don't really use mini a lot. So it looks like every time you level them up, um, you can just... So... There we go. Um, okay, so there we go. So you can kind of like put your little Scrabble coin pieces on in the world. Which honestly looks pretty cute. That looks pretty adorable. Um, so yeah, let me see what that looks like here. So yeah, I just liked it. I just liked the Disney um, Dreamlight because it's super. It's very peaceful. I usually like play this game. Um, whoops. I usually play this game. Rapunzel, you're literally in my shot. I was trying to take a picture of that. So. I, I play this game and I usually listen to books on tape and stuff like that. Your birthday is about to come up. Awesome, Daffy. Like Sims, says Game Wing. Yep, uh, it is like my Sims or, or like the Sims. Yeah, it's... Uh, the best thing about the game, though, is like, you know, like all these interactions like with the characters. Like, they will You're talk here. to you... There's so much to do here. Isn't it amazing? And then you can talk to them and see what they like. There's so much written dialogue for this. So you could actually, like, you know, if you're sad or you don't have a lot of friends over or whatever, or you're lonely, you can actually play this game and they have so much dialogue. It feels like you're in this world of people to talk to. They have written so much dialogue and all of this dialogue, they're... That really t they talk about actual like things that this character would talk about like um, you know Mickey talks about certain things he likes Minnie talks about you know dresses and making cake and things that Minnie likes so they all talk about things that they really enjoy which I like I think that the people that made this game are actually geniuses personally because I think this is a really well made game like I, I hope people will give it a chance it's um, it's very, it is very endearing, it's very fun, it's very uplifting, and it just makes you feel good playing it, so I like it a lot. I guess that's true. Is there anyone you wanted to ask about specifically? Um, so you can ask her about baking and cooking, knitting and sewing, something else. Why don't we ask her about baking, see what she likes to do about that. Well, I love making all sorts of <laughs> treats. I even started inventing my own secret recipes. And the more that you talk to them and do things with them, you level them up. So once you get to a certain level, you're going to get the different prizes on there. The stars. This originally was a free-to-play game, but I'm really glad they make the decision to make it a not a free-to-play game because when it was free-to-play, it had lots of glitches. It was crashing, and they really couldn't... Um, they couldn't keep it up the way that they needed to, so that it's, it's currently forty dollars. So if you guys do feel like getting Dreamlight Valley, and then if you want to get the add-on, which is Eternity Isle, that's another thirty dollars. But the main game is forty dollars, which isn't a bad price, and I think it does give endless hours of entertainment. Like I plan on, I could do up to two hundred episodes on this. I'm probably gonna keep going on the game for a long time. Um, I may start doing, like, a start over in my town for Animal Crossing as well, so. But it gives me something that's very, it, it always gives me something different to do. Alright, so let's actually talk to Rapunzel Hi. and see if she can. She's level 2 on Scrabble Coins, so we could play with her. Uh, this is my new favorite game. Do I like baking apple pie? Halamatwe. I have baked apple pie in in school, in uh, culinary school. Oh 
Um, I have, I think I, I've baked quiches at home. I don't know if I bake pies at home. I really, a lot of the stuff I learned in like baking when I was in my cooking classes and stuff, I haven't really tried out at home because I don't have all, well, mm, I don't, I haven't really been able to successfully make like the crust on top very well. Um, but I, I can easily, like, I know how to make the, like, uh, my own homemade pie crust and all that. Um, I always kind of, I always have to look up the recipe and remember again. But I actually haven't baked all, I baked an apple pie in school, but I haven't baked one at home. Um, just, like, I don't have a lot of time to practice um, my music and stuff that I'd like at home. So let's see what this one, she can move in two spots in any direction. So why don't we put, uh, actually we can put her in here. So we're going to put a uh, fairy godmother in here. But yeah, I mean, I, I've tasted people's homemade apple pie. Um, Luke's aunt does a really good homemade apple pie. I think Martha Stewart, ha I love watching Martha Stewart's recipes of things because I I think she has really good recipes for like pie and things like that. Um, but I have not made it on my own actually. I make, uh, I haven't, I've kind of, when I, I'm kind of teaching myself one food recipe after the other and getting it down. Like every holiday I try to either make ham or turkey or fish, something that's really nice. I'd like to move on to like make, uh, make, you know, I'd love to learn to, uh, every time, everything that I learn to cook, I try to practice many times so I can get it better and better every time. Uh, and, and I get more used to doing it. One thing about cooking is you need to get used to doing it quickly and you need to get used to putting everything in at the right time. But, um, yeah, I, I like, I like pie. I, apple pie is not my favorite kind. My, probably my favorite kind of pie that I like is um raspberry pie. I really like that a lot. And um I I mean I like I like lemon pie. Um I love cheesecake. That's one of my favorite. That's one of my favorite things ever. I really like cheesecake. It's probably my favorite dessert. Um I like key lime pie. Um any kind of berry pie, blueberry pie. I like that. All right, so she can move to in any direction. Uh, oh, and she can be pointed. Uh, she can come in anywhere. Okay, so we're going to go um, with... Um, yeah, Luke is done fine. He's just done sleeping. He only had about three hours of sleep anyway, so he's just sleeping for now. Um, he won't be back if Luke is back. He'll be later. It will be much later tonight. I'm going to do either one or two streams, and then um, I will I will check on him later. If he's, if he's still sleeping and still tired, then I will, um, then I will do another stream. Um, at, um, later tonight. So I'm going to do at least, uh, at least, at least two streams. I think that's my plan. So I don't know what I'll stream after this. So yeah. So you got, I don't know if Luke will be back tonight or not. Um, I don't know. So I will check on him later, um, tonight and see, um, if you know how he's feeling. What about chocolate cream pie, Hello Matue? Um, I think I've had it once or twice. I haven't. Yeah, I think I've had chocolate cream pie once or twice. All right. 
Well, I hope you you guys are having a good night. So yeah, I'm just kind of doing um, filler content. Um, I baked a pie. Um, when I was in school and a couple a couple years ago. I don't really have a lot of time. Like I, I probably baked a quiche, which is like a pie, uh, in the last year. I learned a lot of recipes, but I don't have time to make a lot of recipes because I have to, I'm mainly streaming when you're, so when you're streaming several hours a day, you don't always have time just because I know how to do it. I don't have time to practice it a lot because I'm, I'm working here. So would I rather have a Reese's flavored water or New York patty flavored water? I think New York patty, New York patty is my favorite. I love New York mints. They're really good. Um, I don't know. I don't know if I really want to say good luck, Amber, getting characters. You're doing great. Thank you, um, Shadow Trooper. Appreciate that so much. Thank you. I recently unlocked Kristoff and Donald Duck. Awesome soul, soul storm. Very cool. You not a pie person, Later Gator? Hi, Later Gator. How's it going? Great to see you. So this was actually Later Gator's idea for me to do one of these. And, uh, you know, I wouldn't actually be doing... Uh, the whole reason I'm doing it is because I knew that uh, people were kind of coming after me today. But as soon as I kind of, like... I don't know. As soon as I kind of said, like, well, I'm just playing a board game. I don't really care. They seem to just leave the stream. So I... I don't know. <laughs> I kind of wish they were attacking me the whole time because then they could just get it over, get their anger out over with, but, um, um, okay, so we're gonna, uh, let's see if we can, all right, actually, all right, so we've got, um, All right, so I don't know if I should bring Goofy in yet. Okay, so we're going to... All right, we're going to skip for now. I'm just going to bring in uh, Mr. Scrooge. Would I pay $3 for a pie? Um... Yeah, I mean, like, they sell pies for a lot more than that around here. I would probably pay up to $15 for a pie if it's really good. Um, I got a cheesecake at the grocery store for $5, which was really good. But that's kind of, like, very... That's a pretty good deal. Uh, because it takes a long time to make... You know, you have to make the crust. You have to make... Uh, you have to make the filling, which depending on what kind of pie you're making, you can either make a pie where you actually just cut the, the fruit and put it in the pie and then bake it. And then there's, of course, other types of pie where you're actually sauteing the fruit with like, you know, sugar and some other stuff in a pan and some other ingredients, cinnamon and making this delicious filling that's already cooked and then you put it in the pie. So there's like several different ways you can actually, there's many different recipes for every kind of pie. As I'm more of a, um, I'm not really a pie or a cake person. I like ice cream. I love ice cream. I like cheesecake. That's my kind of thing. That should be our, that could be our uh, poll today. There we go. So, you guys can let me know. I probably should have put ice cream cake in there. Got pie, cake, uh, cheesecake, or 
Uh, oh, a lot of Cheesecake fans. Okay, you guys are already voting on it. Yeah. Yeah, I mean... Okay, so we're actually going to bring in Goofy now, and I'm going to bring him in. We're going to see how far we can get with the Scrabble Coin Tournament. We're going to see. You don't do polls, Game Wing? Okay. Cheesecake says later Gator. Um, I don't know what my Scrabble coin level is. I didn't even know I was at a Scrabble coin level. Oh, I was defeated. Oh my gosh. I got defeated. Um, I guess I'm at level 60. I'm not sure. Wow. So I... Should we rematch them? No, that's okay. We won't. <laughs> Would I pay $100 for a box of donuts? Probably not. No. <laughs> Maybe... I don't know. Depending on how good the donuts are, uh, like if they're gourmet donuts or something, I wouldn't pay 100 I'd pay like 12 if they're really good. I don't know. I don't know how much a thing of Dunkin'... I don't know how much a box of Dunkin' Donuts is, actually. A uh, box of donuts from Dunkin' Donuts. I don't know how much that is. I know, like, a thing of mun- I found, like, a thing of munchkins. Like, the little donut holes are, like, is it either $5 or $2.50? I don't remember. Okay. Alright, so I'm just putting all this stuff into my uh, thing. Oh, good. We could sell some of that. We have a lot of cumin here. Oh. And this little leaf, that little feather is actually a spice. Alright, a lot of cumin. If they make the... I'm at 61. Oh, okay, thank you, uh, thank you, uh, the eyes. You chose cheesecake, awesome soul storm, very cool. I love cheesecake. That's my favorite. What if they make the Grim Adventures of Billy and Mandy video game? That would be pretty cool. Hala Matwe. Um, hi, uh, Daniel. You like cake? Awesome. I voted for ice cream. I consider both ice cream and cake. There you go, uh, Jacob. Yeah, I should have put ice cream cake. Then that, that would have won the poll. Hi, Bowman. I voted cake because I like cake. Awesome, Bowman. Yeah, Luke is a fan of cake. He likes it. Uh, that's the next thing I want to learn to get good at cooking for Luke is um, making cake. So on his birthday and, and other, you know, a different, you know, once I have kids, I would like to cook their cake so I don't have to buy the cake from the store. I think it would be nice to be able to like, also it's more special if you cook cake for somebody than if you buy it. I'm always getting a 20, you know, $10 cake from the store or something like that and, and it's like, oh, I could definitely could uh, make this for less money. <sighs> All right, so we can actually go. Um, oh, I'll show you guys the Cave of Wonders that we went in last time. Toast cake, awesome PJ. So it is um, ten o'clock. Not, not a fan of cake. Uh, no worries. Uh, no worries, Game Wing. Okay, so I'm gonna try to... Um, 
Oh wow, it's cake winning the poll. Oh my goodness. So I'm just trying to share the video a little bit. So usually I'm sharing the video while we're streaming, but I can't really share it very well while I'm in the middle of the stream, but we're going to do the best we can. If they make a code game, what if they make a code game of the kids next door? That would be pretty cool, Halamatwe. Hello, Snow Owl. Hi, everyone. Yeah, um, I'm just trying to think of what cool games are coming out soon. I'm not even sure what, um, what games. I know there's, like, a lot of M-rated games coming out, so I'm just trying to think of what we're gonna, what we're gonna be doing soon. You like ice cream? Awesome game wing. I love I ice cream ice between ice cream and cheesecake, it's very hard for me to decide. Mm, I'm thinking if if I do have the if I am up all night on my own, one thing I might make myself is some Brussels sprouts on the stove. I got some Brussels sprouts to practice making for Easter and I didn't Time end up making them. She sells sea smells by the seashore. She sells sea smells by the seashore. She sells sea smells by the seashore. Alright, great job with the likes everyone. That that helps the channel out tremendously. Um, Don't forget to like if you guys haven't already. So it looks like we're at 81 likes. Thank you guys for the help. I really appreciate that everyone. Okay. Alright, so I'm gonna go um, try to find... I was just trying to share the video a little bit on a Facebook and all that. Alright, so it looks like we're at 82. Thank you guys so much. Alright, so let's go see the Cave of Wonders and to see what that looks like. So basically in this game, if you guys are not familiar with Disney Dreamlight Valley, you're just gonna... Kind of be picking up stuff. We've got some dates that we just harvested. Um, you're going to be picking up flowers from the ground. All kinds of stuff you can mine. Stuff. It's like Animal Crossing, basically. It is very similar to Animal Crossing. Harvest Moon Animal Crossing. Um, the, the, the big difference between Animal Crossing and this game is that you actually get to talk to Disney characters. So... I mean, that's really the key point of the game is just interacting with them. and You get cool stories about um, different things. You get to unlock a garden for Wally. You get to unlock stuff for Gaston. Um, you know, and uh, we can actually show uh, Rapunzel. I can show you guys um, Rapunzel's cool tower, which I unlocked uh, a couple of streams ago, which looks really cool, actually. So you get like, you know, you get to kind of interact with your favorite Disney characters. So that's really nice. Okay, so let's see, what were we doing? Where? Okay, so there we go, the Cave of Wonders. So we can actually go in the Cave of Wonders, which is really cool. And it did kind of spring out of the ground. So this is the Cave of Wonders. We were in here last time, uh, last stream. I'm going to put a uh, thing in here. All right. So this is kind of, uh, um, we kind of already did a lot of the stuff that was in this, which was basically just kind of trying to get out of the Cave of Wonders, but I didn't really have a ton of time to, um, I didn't really have a ton of time to, like, uh, look through the Cave of Wonders, so we can kind of look through it. All of these lasers are just to open the doors in the Cave of Wonders.
we got some coinage there. Okay. And yeah, apparently the lasers don't kill us, so that's that's good. Uh, hi, Blue Sea Dragon. Says I'm back. How's the stream going? Um, it's going better, Blue Sea Dragon. Alright, so this is, um, so I actually didn't go over here. Okay, so here's an part of the Cave of Wonders we can't go to yet. So some plants that we can't really get rid of yet. So that's an area I can't go to. And this is the big monkey statue up here uh, that we took something from. So you can't really interact with it again. It looks really cool. So this is the part in Aladdin where he took that thing from the monkey statue and then they had to fly out on the magic carpet, which is actually uh, Luke's favorite Disney movie is um, Aladdin, actually. He loves that movie. I think we actually did like a, a screw attack singing contest where... Anyone who was on the Screw Attack website could enter it, and we, we, I believe we did like a duet of that, where I sang Jasmine's part and Luke sang um, uh, Aladdin's part. That was kind of cute, actually. Alright, so. Um, we might even be able to do a. Like a. Some of the. We might. If we come across some tasks that need to be done from some villagers, we can always do some of their their stuff that they need done. Yeah, we're gonna see how far we can get in Scrabble Point. Yep, that's right. Uh, oh wait, infidels, you will never you have touched the forbidden treasure, you will never again see the light of day. Yep, exactly. Yeah, I thought, I'm trying to remember who that was, um, yeah. I think that was, was it a boo that touched it? I don't remember who touched it. Alright, so we got all kinds of stuff. So I'm hoping something, uh, All right. Yeah, so I mean, I think Luke will probably be on later t if he's able to. It will make him feel better. It helps him to, you know. Um, he likes to know that the channel's doing better. He just, it makes him feel better to know that. Alright, so I am going. Sorry about that, guys. So we got to see the Cave of Wonders. That was pretty cool. So we can try to uh, we can try to um, find somebody else that we can play Scrabble Coin with. All right, now we have work to do. Who's a better mermaid, Ariel or Peach? Um, Ariel's probably the best mermaid, I think. Um. Uh, the, the eyes. Well, hello. Ah, uh, okay, Wing. I presume you've noticed the strange debris littered all over in terms of the Isle. Some of the ancient rubble strewn about ancient landing. Ah, uh, stalagmites made of glass and the glimmering dunes. And malicious plants sprouting all over the wild tangle. Ah, uh, they're blocking me from decorating. Oh, yes, you know, it's curious. Your royal tools should remove the debris. But it appears that the ma magic of Eternity Isle has seeped into them. They're frozen in time. To destroy them, you'll need the magic of the hourglass and time-bending table. 
Examine the echoes from the past on your time-bending table. There must be some way for you to make potions to infuse your royal tools with the m magic you need. I take my hat to you. Yeah, I think this is so well, cool. That is dangerous. so cool. I think in Disney you. Infinity, I wanted to make the Cave of Wonders. And right here in Disney Dreamlight Valley, here it is. Really interesting. Looks really cool. And we uh, we have... Well, we have 8,000. So we are really close to opening like this area, which is 10,000. So we can actually fast travel. Um, Alright, so we can actually... Um, Oh, wow. We are really close now. Okay, so we can fast travel back. Uh, oh, yeah. I'm going to show you guys where um, where she is. So this is... Uh, this is... Um, if anyone has not seen this, this is um, Rapunzel's ha home. Um, what if they would make a uh, real-life action Mickey Mouse movie? Like what they did with Sonic the Hedgehog? That would be interesting, Um, I would be curious to see what that would be like. It would be cool if they um, made it like Walt Disney was running around with Mickey Mouse. Like if they had somebody who could play Walt Disney, that would be kind of cool personally or if Mickey was just hanging out with just uh you know Mickey just they just had a random protagonist or somebody that just met Mickey randomly uh, that would be interesting I wonder how that would work um I wonder where the wisecracking parrot is says Nostalgia Joey he was wandering, uh, flying around in Dreamlight. Oh, interesting, Miss <laughs> Joy. You liked the Aladdin series after Return of the Jaf Jafar? Also, Miss Joy. Yeah, I think Luke really liked Return of, Return of Jafar. I don't remember if he watched the series or not. I may have seen a little bit of that series. So, you just want to keep, uh, you know, collecting as many things as possible because... At any time, you're going to have, like, a, a quest where they're going to ask you for, like, 50 pieces of this. So if you collect two pieces once in a while, every, you know, every once in a while, you'll collect a couple pieces. Um, oh, wait, here we go. Ooh. All right. All right, so I can show you guys um, the tangled area. Let's see if we can find it. Okay, so this is her. Okay, so we're actually going. We're actually going towards her. Her. Um, there's her tower, so we can actually go in it. So there is um, Rapunzel's tower. You can see it in the background, and I don't know why, but I see constellations in the sky. That's kind of cool. It would work like Chippendale Rescue Rangers. Awesome nostalgia. -y. That would be really cool. Alright, hi, hi, Daniel. Hi, uh, Julia. Hi, the eyes. Um, I don't know. Maybe they were making a Steamboat Willie horror movie. Hi, Larray. Um, uh, hi, Anthony. Hi, JS. Hi, Jonathan. Hi Bowman, hi PJ, hi everyone. Hi Game Wing 1, hello everybody. Wow, Pi is winning, unbelievable. Hi Hala Montaue, hi Game Kid 28, hello Captain Zack. Hi Shadow Trooper, hi John Raymond, hi um, Daffy Duck, hello everyone. Hmm. 
All right, great job with the likes, guys. We are just eight away from uh, from a hundred likes. Fantastic, everyone. So this is uh, so this is Rapunzel's house, actually. It's very pretty. She's got paintings all over the wall, and it's very cute. So this is her tower. She's got like, these paintings and stuff like that. And there's out the, so just really really cute actually. Pi is winning, says so Jacob Orion. Apparently so, Jacob. I have seen the I haven't seen the TV series, but I did see the movies. Awesome, Jonathan. Hi Later Gator. Hi Anthony. Hi uh Game Wing One. Hello, uh, Nostal Joey. Hi, everyone. Hope you guys are all having a great day. Hi, J Dog. I don't, I'm not, I mean, I don't know anything about the, I don't, I don't watch horror movies on J Dog. So I don't, I don't have an opinion on it too much. <laughs> Alright, so where are we going next? Why don't we try to find, maybe we can play Goofy with Scrabble Coin. And we're going to see how far we can get with Scrabble Coin. Let's go. Hey there, K-Wing. Do you want to play Scrabble Coin, Goofy? Oh, let's get Scrabbling. Alright, we're going to play Goofy. Oh, thank you for the prayers. Um, Jonathan, appreciate that so much. Thank you. Would I rather sing an undersea ballad in the Atlantica or sing backing vocals for a mermaid peach? Um, I don't know. That's a good question. That's a good question. Um, I think background... Both of them are fun. I love... I mean, background vocals for, for Peach sound really nice. I think, uh, in truth, though, I'd probably want to sing my own, uh, my own song. So, as you can see, it kind of says where they can go here. So, yeah. So, here we go. Haven't I heard of Disney Epic Mickey Rebrushed? Um, yes. I think we, I thought we played that. Reboot of Mickey for the Wii and it was coming to console. I saw the direct. Awesome, Cyrus. Oh, okay. Yeah, I think Luke is planning on playing the new, the, the remake or the remastered of that. You feel like Chip and Dale, uh, Risk Rangers movie was better than the series? Interesting, Nostalgia. Yeah, I liked the new Chip and Dale movie. I also really liked the uh, Chip and Dale, uh, Rescue Rangers. Oh, the, no. Yeah. Wait, were Chip and Dale and the Rescue Rangers? I thought they were. Ch -ch -ch Chip and Dale, Rescue Rangers, Ch -ch Chip and Dale. Ch -ch -ch Chip and Dale. Yep. All right, we got Lumiere here. Yeah, I'm hoping we can get a Nintendo Direct. Chippendale, Rescue Rangers. That's right, Leader Gator. Okay. Alright, we're going to move Scrooge McDuck over here. So we just have two people on the board at the moment. Alright. 
Um, I guess we'll put Donald Duck on here. Why not? I like Donald Duck's theme song. It's one of my favorites. Who's got the sweetest disposition? One duck, that's who. Who never, never start an argument. Who's got something temperament? Who's never wrong? He's always right. Who never dream of starting a fight? Who gets stuck with all the bad luck? No one but Donald Duck. Like, I remember seeing the old cartoon with Donald Duck a long time ago. He's one of my favorite characters because I like how he just gets frustrated with everything. Um, yeah, I've watched a lot of the really old uh, Disney cartoons. They're, they're pretty funny. I like the one where he's like, he can't get to sleep and he's just like, here's the train going and the water dripping and stuff. That one is a really funny cartoon. What if we got a Chippendale Rescue Rangers game? That would be pretty awesome later, Gator. Definitely. Um, let's see. So what's uh, well, I guess we can go... You guys are at 93 likes? Awesome! Alright guys, yeah, um, just a few likes away from 100. Great job, everyone. I think we're actually at 97 likes now. So that's good. Great job, everybody. Okay. All right, there goes Lumiere. Donald Duck talks funny. My favorite Disney opening theme is Chippendale, Rescue Rangers, and DuckTales. Yes, Duck DuckTales is one of the best theme songs ever, Chad. Definitely. I love that. I love that theme song. Probably, I don't know if I'll get copyright for the Donald Duck song, but probably get copyright if I sing the uh, DuckTales is one of the best yeah it's like one of the most um, just like top tier uh, animated cartoons ever I love DuckTales it's fun to sing like in your room and stuff on your own with the top of your li lungs like just to sing the DuckTales woo <laughs> just really fun it's a fun song to sing and to listen to. Oh, wow. Pi is winning. Wow. That's a pretty... Okay. Alright. So let's all get back to the Scrabble coin. Okay. So where are we? I think I'm going to skip bringing it. Okay, so wow. All right, so we got Donald Duck over there. Um, Um, I don't know if I, I can't get all the coins here. All right. So we, we played with Goofy. We got a victory, but it didn't really count on our path since we already played with him. 
I didn't remember we played with Goofy already. All right, great job, everyone. Um, you guys are doing fantastic. Need anything from the market? Just come see me. Um, sure thing, Goofy. Mm -hmm. All right, I'm gonna just uh, fill my cup with coffee, guys and gals. For uh, just gonna rush over t and put some more coffee in it. So why don't we try, uh, we already played D Donald, we already played Goofy, I guess we can play Gaston, see what he thinks. Uh, now these are some conversations you get to have over here. The shape, your strength, it's obviously what you are. Hmm. An enormous egg. So he's calling Eve an enormous egg. No. Oh, you can tell me the truth, Eve. No. Grr. So just like all these cute little conversations between different Disney characters of different movies. This I feel like that's kind of what makes the game worth it. It's very cute. Um, alright. Ah, who's gonna polish my boots in this town? Are you upset about something, Gaston? Hmm, there's something off in this place. I can't quite put my finger on it. Is it the villagers? No. <laughs> Though none of them are interested as interesting as me, it's something else. Please, the other villagers are at least um, interested in something in you. Ha, ah, I've got it. It's a terrible lack of decorations. Picture the antlers everywhere on every wall. Wouldn't that be magnificent? Um, I'll get right on it. I knew you'd understand, K-Wing. Move along. So they I'm just have really fun conversations. And if you want to level, like right now, we've got to kind of level him up a little bit. So the best way to do that, what characters really like, whether it's a girl or a guy character, they really seem to like flowers. So I don't know if I have any flowers around. I don't see a lot of flowers around here that I can uh, pluck. My inventory is full. Okay, good. So we have flowers. Let's give him some flowers. Let's see if we can get Gaston to level... Uh... If we can get him to level two, then we can hang out with him. Oh, you just can't stay away, can you? I'm not surprised. Um. Oh, we can't give him... Oh, yes, we can give him a gift. So we'll give him one of these plants. I don't think he'll like that. This is worthy of Gaston. You just can't stay away, can you? Right, so let's try to give him a flower, see what he says. So we can just give him one of these. <laughs> yep. What if they would make a real life action Tom and Jerry? That would be interesting. Hollow Mott away. This is worthy of Gaston. You just can't stay away. All right, so we're going to try to give him enough flowers to be our friend. Oh, it's very close on this one. It's almost level two. Let's 
All right, we finally got to level two. Once we get to level two, I believe you can hang out with them. So we leveled Gaston up. All right, I feel like Gaston should be a fisher because he likes fishing and hunting. So we're going to go with that. You there. Ah, we anyone in need of a uh, strappingly handsome here? Uh, how are you settling in, Gaston? Need a hand with anything? Well, ah. I ever, I never need a hand. But you could use one, right? Oh. Can you promise anything? <laughs> I decide to do. I excel it. Glad to hear you're enjoying your time here. Mm, I may be settled here, but that doesn't mean I'll be enjoying it. I have to say, I'm not impressed by the community at all. Well, uh, there's always room for improvement. There is something that would help you feel more at home. Most definitely. <laughs> Appropriate ad adoration. Buckets of praise. And not, um, importantly, and most importantly, a piece, a place for all this to happen. Oh, he wants a house. Um, what did you have in mind, Gaston? Uh, I can see it already. A rustic hunting lodge. My latest kill roasting over the fire and me in the middle holding court among admiring fans. Yeah, I'm not sure about the last part, Gaston, but I can help you get a lodge going. Mm-hmm. <laughs> uh, usually LeFou handled this sort of thing. Hmm. But yeah. since he's not here, I suppose you could be a substitute LeFou. Um, perfect. Ah, enthusiasm. <sighs> That's just what I need. Uh, ah. I built a lodge um, so a, ages ago in the, in the wastes. Let's meet there. I want to show you how it looks after my time stuck down in the desert. Ha ha ha. Center of attention. How odd. So we can do that quest. All right. So we actually have to meet Gaston. Um... All right, we can actually hang out with Gaston now. So that means he'll he'll go with us wherever we're going. Um, so we're supposed to go to the Wastes for the other... So it looks like the Wastes are... Oh, there they are. They're all the way up there. So it is, uh, let's see. I don't know if I'm going to end up doing another stream or not on my own. This just shows how hard Luke works because he handles a lot of the streams on his own. So um, it just shows that he's, he is a very hard worker. All right, so we can actually try to uh, go to um, the hunting lodge in the waste. So let's give that a try. All right, so we are going to actually um, go right over here. So we actually unlocked a new area with Gaston. Um, I'm just going to go uh, check on uh, my... Let's see, my cat is meowing at me at the moment. I'm just gonna go check on them. One second, guys, sorry about that. I'm gonna move away from this so it doesn't have the weird humming sound. Okay. Wait, one second.
Alright, sorry about that, guys. Um, my cat was uh, having problems, so... Alright, everything should be fine. So we're gonna go to the waste area. And that should be um, over here, uh, up here. So all we need to do is actually find follow Goofy. He's going in that direction. So there may or may not be another stream tonight. If there is, it'll probably just be me. Just so you guys know. Alright, so it looks like this is Gaston's um, lodge. So let's go in it. Yeah, it's not, um, Luke isn't gonna be, just so you guys know, Luke isn't planning on, Luke isn't gonna be streaming at all tonight. I don't believe he is going to be. If, if he is streaming, it'll be after 1am. Like, it will not be, but don't count on it. So, yes, he's very tired, so. Sorry about that, everyone, but it's probably for the best he gets to sleep today. All right, uh, Gaston, let's see. Oh, look at this place. Uh, yeah, it's pretty rough, I guess. <gasps> hey, only I'm allowed to say that, but yeah, you're right. This will take a bit of work, K-Wing. Normally, I just tell the food to handle things, but... Uh, Gaston, hello. Oh, what are, what was I saying? Uh, renovations? All right, came <laughs> Well, first we need to clear out all of this sand and do something about that portrait of mine. <sighs> it's insulting for me to be in such a state. Try <gasps> using your fancy hourglass on it and let me know when you're done. Um, sure. Excellent. Lefou I mean, the K-Wing. All right, time to get to work. Alright, so let's see what the quest is here. Uh, it says, dig up the sand piles inside Gaston's lodge, revert the ruined portrait in Gaston's lodge by interacting with it. Center of attention. Um, he's very, Lucas wasn't very tired. Basically, uh, we had a difficult day, and also Lucas tired anyway. I, I, uh, we had several reasons why today was difficult. Uh, we had streams obviously hacked, and then earlier my my blood pressure was very high. It was like at one seventy, so I had to wake Luke up, and he was like helping me with my blood pressure earlier today. So, um. So he hasn't really gotten very much sleep today because I had to go to the doctor today. So, and he had to help me with that. So that, so basically he has not slept at all. So it's good. It's actually worked out perfectly. I mean, not that it was good that we got hacked, but this is fine because he can actually take a rest. Okay. Clean up the sand piles um, of Gaston's Lodge. Revert the ruined portrait and... Yes, I'm lost by interacting with it. Okay, so let's uh, let's try that. So we're gonna do a few like actual missions. So I guess we didn't only do Scrabble Coin this time. All right, so let's uh, let's get our shovel out here and try to dig stuff. So yeah, I do not know if Luke will be coming back tonight on streams. Uh, if he does, it will be after one in the morning. So, you know, just so you guys know, you know, it will just be me. I don't know if I'm going to do another. There will be a short that's going up at 11 o'clock. So you guys can stay tuned for that. And I'll try to remember to push that short. Uh, revert these... Ruin portrait. Okay. Um. 
All right. All right, so we are gonna, okay, so we reverted the painting back. Let's talk to Gaston. Ah, K-Wing, um, all done. How do you feel about it now? Oh, no, this isn't right. This isn't right at all, K-Wing. It, uh, don't worry, Gaston, we can fix this. You're sounding more and more like LeFou every day. Oh, <laughs> let me see. Yes, this whole lodge requires furniture and kelp. Careful renovation. <laughs> Tell me, is my old friend Scrooge McDuck still running the shop? Um, he is. Ha ha, excellent, K-Wing. He supplied funding before I set out from the valley. I'm sure he'd want to invest in it in again. Bring him some Alexandrite, Jade, and Spine. Spinel, not Spine. Why do I keep wanting to say Spine? He should be rare, raring to find his new adventure. Okay. All right, so we have to find Jade, Spinel, and Alexandrite. I don't know where we're going to find Jade at. Okay. Well, we might not be able to complete this one today. So, to find um, Jade and some other things... Um, I guess we're just going to go and try to mine some uh, different gems, but... Alright, so I think I see some mining spots over here. Yeah, this is a very relaxing game. I don't know if I'm going to end up playing a, another game later tonight on uh, maybe... If there is a new character in Fortnite, I'm downloading the update right now. So it's possible we could do that or could do another game. Uh, I'm not sure, actually. I can see into the future. All right, so return to Merlin using the time bending table. Craft the following small rubber shovel, small glass stalagmite. Oh, so I never actually talked to Merlin after this. So let's uh, see what's going on. Hello. Oh, marvelous, your royal tools. I've been infused with the magic of the hourglass. You should have no trouble removing the smaller pieces of rubble, the glass stalagmites, and the malicious plants. Though I'm afraid the larger ones may require more research. Research. I don't want to research to clean stuff up. Ah, oh, such determination. Quite admirable. Well, I'm off to my library to do just that. I'll be sure to let you know if anything comes up. <laughs> Village project timeless trash complete. Timeless trash is complete. It's uh, just for ultimate members. I wish uh, people could choose what they could do on their birthday, but 
No, it's just our ultimates get to choose the game. Regular members, you get the emotes. And you get the, um, I mean, you get the satisfaction of knowing you're helping keep the channel on the air. Uh, um, you also get uh, Discord access. That's my inner voice. And um, um, if there is a community stream, that's, you know, that, that it's hard to get into. And that there, there could be, you know, there are sometimes members um, only uh, parts on those. Uh, you also get notified uh, better in the chat. You also get your, um, yeah, it's basically the emotes and Discord. You get our friend codes as a member, but no, the, um, the yeah, unfortunately, the it's, it's the ultimate tier that's the request to game. But um, I, have, I hope you have a wonderful birthday this month, uh, Jonathan, and thank you so much for becoming a member. Only you can help. Um, it helps the channel out tremendously. Thank you so much. Okay, all right. So I'm gonna put some of the stuff from my pockets uh, away here. All right. What if? Uh, Oh, what if Tom Holland played the role? Interesting, Um Hi, uh, PJ. Hi, uh, Game Wing. Hi, Chad. Hi, JS. Hi, Jedi. Knight Robert. Hello, um, uh, the the eyes. Hello, everyone. Okay, see you later, later Gator. Good night. Thank you for hanging out. And thank you for all your generosity, everyone, today. Um, uh, the super chats and new memberships. Thank you for becoming an ultimate game wing. And I really appreciate that on, uh, so much. Thank you so much. And thanks for the super chats. Um, Justo and everyone else today. I really appreciate that, everyone. Okay, have a great night later, Gator. Thank you. We have work to do. All right, so these are some of the things they wanted. Spinal, uh, or s not spinal, yeah, spinal, uh, alexandrite. Okay. Um, I guess I'll just... <sighs> All right, there we go. And it is 10. Okay. All right. I'm just putting stuff uh, from my pockets in into uh, different bins so that I can just uh, have more room in my pockets here. All right, and looks like we've got garlic over here. Okay. Actually, those were dates, so. Technically. All right, looks like I still have some flowers. So sorry, guys, this kind of takes a while. I'm just, I'm just emptying my pockets. All right, there we go. So, all right, so, oh, we actually do have all of that. Uh, find yourself, oh no, we don't. We need, we need that in our pockets. So we have, we do not have any, uh, um, let's see. So he wants Jade, Jade, um, Alexandrite, Alexandrite, and um spinal okay there are spinel 
All right, so I think we can talk to Gaston. I think we complete that quest. Ah, oh, you just can't stay away, can you, K-Wing? I'm not surprised. Ah, ha, 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 ha. All right, center of attention. What should I do? Ah. Let me know what Miss Mr. McDuck says about the furnishings, and be sure to bring him some new gems when you visit. All right, now we have to find Scrooge McDuck then. All right, and he is right down here. He's actually right next to me. You can see from the map, he's over here. Uh, there he is. All right, and here we go. Scrooge McDuck. So he's going to help decorate Gaston's house. Oh, greetings, neighbor. I have Mortal Kombat in the brain. Maybe Game Wing. I don't know. I haven't played a lot of Mortal Kombat, but maybe I'm used to seeing Luke or other people play it. <laughs> yeah, get over here. Whatever. Wait, that's... Yeah, it is Mortal Kombat. Okay, Wing, these gems are magnificent. Uh -huh. What brings you here to see me with such a wonderful gift? Um, I have an opportunity for you, Mr. McDuck. <laughs> Oh, an opportunity do you have? I, you know me well. I'm always interested in a new opportunity. So, uh, I've been hanging out with Gaston. Oh, Gaston. Uh, I thought we were rid of that blowhard. Does he still have more muscles than brains? Uh, that's a way to describe him, Mr. Whoa. McDuck. <laughs> oh, I, I thought so. Huh? What does Gaston want? Well, we're trying to figure out uh, fix up the lodge. I managed to restore some of it, but the interior is pretty bare. Do you think you could help out? Oh, oh, well, since you brought me here a valuable gift, I suppose I could help out some. Oh. I think I have some furnishings in storage somewhere that would be appropriate for Gaston's unique tastes. Great. Oh, no, oh, the oh. Uh, gems will get you quite a uh, bit, but the rest won't come in uh, free. After all, I have a business to run. Uh, what would you want for them? Mm. <laughs> uh, a cut of the profits? 50% seems fair. Mm. How about 25? You, you drive a hard bargain, uh -huh. but I cannot accept, I can accept the terms. Great. But if you're trying to make restore the same lodge that I remember, you might need more furnishings to return it to its former condition. Uh, it's true. The exterior is still falling apart. Never fear. You should be able to gather the rest resources you need for the renovations. Oh, the island uh, should have the oasis glass, tropical wood, and copper to get to the uh, lodge fixed up and have our and here you are uh, Gaston's antler chair and a, a crate of furniture thank you uh, Mr. McD uh, and here you are um, thank you Mr. McDog appreciate that all right so it says we need a lot of copper a lot of glass and a lot of wood so we already have a crate and we already have Gaston's uh, antler chair. So we need a copper, oasis glass, and tropical wood. So let's see if we already have that in our inventory. Because so, I always don't go by and pick things up as I'm wandering around. Okay, so we've got... Uh... Alright, and it's almost... Uh, um time for the short so I'll try to push that when I see that all right so um, okay so we're looking for copper we are looking for glass and we are looking for one other thing copper glass and uh, tropical wood there we go All right, so like we can talk to. Oh wow, we need a lot more than this though. We need tropical. We need a lot more tropical wood. Tropical. Okay, we just need to go get some more wood then. Oh wow, we're gonna need a lot more of that wood. Wow. So okay, so we're gonna need to go to the um, tangled area and see if we can get some more wood. All we need is five pieces.
No, um, the, the, we don't have an option for anyone to choose something for their birthday. Um, don't, you know, we, we don't have, it's not part of the ultimate members. They, they, we, uh, schedule them in during the month. We don't have any special things, um, for people's birthdays. Sorry about that, Jonathan. Um, we can try to say happy birthday to you on your birthday, but we don't have any special, um, we don't do special streams for people on their birthday. Sorry about that. All right, thank you for the super chat, Aqua. Um, really appreciate that. Thank you. Ultimate really wanted to do it. That they wanted to make, uh, but you realize that Ultimates are paying the price of 20 memberships for that month. So you know, you know what I mean. So like they're they're sacrificing quite a lot to be an Ultimate. So you know they they probably are gonna want a game that they would like to see. Um, but yeah, if someone was really nice and wanted to sponsor a stream just for your birthday maybe they would do that i don't know it's possible thank you for the super chat um, Aqua Dolphin. all right uh Aqua Dolphin says um uh, uh Aqua Dolphin says up uh, k wings and family Behold, Aqua Dolphin! Thank you, Aqua, you're breathtaking! All right, hope you're having a great night, Aqua Dolphin. Okay. Okay, our channel popped up for you, Fade. That's good. Well, that's good to hear. It doesn't usually pop up, so that's really good. Alright, so if we can find four more pieces of tropical wood, we can finish this quest for Gaston, and it's very possible um, we could, it's, we might be able to do another stream tonight, we'll see. Thank you, Aqua. Hope you're having a great day. The Cringe Slayer's here. Aqua's here for the cringe. And we are playing Scrabble Coin on a stream that's been two hours. So that if that's not cringy, I don't know what is, Aqua. <laughs> I hope you're having a great day, my friend. Great to see you, Aqua Dolphin. And hope everything's well with you. Thanks for uh, the super chat. Really appreciate that. Thank you, Aqua. Yeah, I mean, the only, uh, yeah, if an ultimate, uh, member wants to change their, uh, if their stream to what somebody wants for their birthday, I mean, they could, they could do that if they were really nice. Okay. All right. But, uh, all right, so, uh. All right, so we are uh, still looking for pieces of tropical wood. There's a lot about this valley that reminds me of home. All right, looks like we actually do have 10,000 mist points. So I have half a mind to open more of this up for more tropical wood, but... I don't think I'm going to because we've been waiting to open the sand area up for quite some time. 
So I think I'm just going to try to, okay, we're just going to see if we can come up. So the, the wood is usually falling right um, where some trees are. Um, let's see here. Okay, we got some more tropical wood. Sorry, I just kind of spaced out there for a second. Sorry about that. Alright, so we got another piece. We're, we're three pieces of tropical wood away. We make a great team. Am I right? And uh, there's the, here's the cringe aqua. Here's Mike Wazowski in his weird jacket. He's literally wearing his jacket on his head. Here. <laughs> I'm Mike Wazowski. Hello. Nice to see you, pal. <laughs> Are you, uh, squinting? Yeah, I think my eyesight's getting worse. Uh, wow, that would be really a big problem for you. Yeah, since I mostly eyeball. I probably huh. just need a new prescription. Yeah. Do you think I could pull off glasses? Uh, I mean glass? You'd look great, Mike. Really? Huh? I guess I'd, I'll think about this. Thanks, pal. So you can get special just points just by talking to them, and they have really fun, cute um, conversations that they have, which is super cute. So we're just going to look at the base of some of the trees to see if we can find this tropical wood. All right, so let's see. Um, we just need a few more pieces of tropical wood. And then we can... Uh... Well, I don't see any pieces of tropical wood yet. Whoops, sorry about that, guys. Guess I am a little getting up there in this, uh, haven't had, usually I'm used to Luke, uh, handing a lot of the streams and then, uh, yeah, it's been a long night for both of us. Well, I really just need three more pieces of tropical wood. So let's see if they, maybe they can reappear or something. Feliz noche. Buenas noches. Um, hopefully we can find another piece. I don't know. Sure is a pretty night. I love Goofy's personality in this. It's very cute. Okay, so I don't actually see a lot more tropical wood here. If we can find more pieces, uh, three more pieces of tropical wood, we can complete this task, but I don't really see any more tropical wood, so I don't know if this is possible. Yep, I don't see how I'm going to find the tropical wood and complete this. Um, we might have to move on to something else, like planting flowers or something. Well, I cannot seem to find the tropical wood. A 
All right, so I, um, yeah, I don't see any tropical wood here, so I guess we're just going to have to warp home. I can tell Luke that you bought him the monkey when he gets up, which will be after one or two in the morning tonight. I'll oh, probably wake up. So, well, we weren't able to get more tropical wood, which kind of is terrible. Okay, we're gonna go back where we were. Alright, so we got back and uh, so we were literally missing three pieces of tropical wood. I don't know if we can actually go back there and try to get it. Maybe if we, maybe if we warp back there we can see if we can find it. Okay, so we we didn't weren't able to finish that quest with Gaston. Let's see what kind of quests are there. Search the forgotten relics around the village. Uncover the truth. Um, keep an eye witness for keep an eye out for alien toys. Oh, let's see. Catch some of the strange things. So we're just going to check on all of this stuff. Oh, it's so beautiful the music here. Well, let's go into the let's go into the um store and see what it's like in there. Sorry about that. All right. So Everything here Pink jacket. So Luke's not gonna wear fun. that. All right. So this is all the really fancy stuff he has on top. Remember, Honestly, some of this money. is very expensive, but. And the Amber, you're running into walls. Why am I not surprised? Have a bull market day. Great. So this care this person was in uh imagine their mind like uh created, but then they're they're waking up thinking they're a real person. Oh no. Alright guys, um so, yeah, I mean, like, we tried to do the Gaston quest. We are missing uh, some of that. Um, there is a short. I can direct you guys to that. Uh, 
bit that short, which should be right after this. Let me just see if I can put it in. Nope, it's not letting me direct to the short. So let's see if uh, the short is up. So, <sighs> um, I don't think I said I have time for anything. I, I I said anything about 11.30. guys if you guys can uh, show the new YouTube shorts some love that would that would help out tremendously and uh, good job guys Pi actually won the poll so um, so anyways we you know we did a lot today we were able to unlock Gaston's uh, area and we just need three more pieces of wood and we can decorate it so that can be next time so um, So there's uh, kind of a fun pose with Gaston who loves to pose. So uh, I hope you guys had fun. I did. Thank you guys for the super chats and everything like that. There may or may not be another stream tonight. I don't know. and um, But there will be a YouTube short and it's going up uh, right now. It just went up. So you guys can definitely show that some love. Um, the stream today were pretty messed up. And, uh, so everything kind of got messed up, but thanks again, Game Wing, for becoming an ultimate. Thank you for, uh, I, some people renewing on Twitch and some super chats today. So thank you for your generosity today, guys and gals. Hopefully tomorrow will be better. Um, so thank you again, everyone, for watching. Thank you for your generosity, everyone. And, uh, yep, the YouTube short just went up right now. Have a great night, everyone, and... Um, have a terrific evening. God bless and happy gaming. See ya. Thanks for watching.